Hello, everybody. Welcome to another Wednesday Lunch Live Sketch. My name is Frank Summers. It's been a hot minute since the last time I have done one of these. I think it was October. Uh, so it's been a little while. Um, thanks for joining me. Uh, so uh, I've been playing. If you're new to the Wednesday Lunch Live Sketch, we pick a topic once a week this week, and we do it for 25 minutes. We try and get as far as we can with it. I sometimes go over. Uh, I've been playing a lot of Breath of the Wild lately. So I've got Zelda and Link on the mind. Um, so. With that said, we're going to go into Photoshop. And I have some reference here because I'm not, you know, I don't, some of his detailing on his wardrobe is a little, is lost to me. So I'm going to start my timer on my phone over here. 25 minutes. And away it goes. Okay. Whew, it's been a while. Let's see. If I have an idea of what I think I want to do, lower the opacity a little bit on this brush. Um, I did a bunch of thumbnails, and I kind of like the idea of him looking off somewhat determinedly. He always has like a look of determination on his fake face, and he's always kind of rocking the bow. So. figure the bow is kind of important and maybe he's got his hand on the string or something and the bow could be the diagonal of the bow could be around here and the bow could be something along that and uh, I'd say the weight is on this foot the front foot and then this foot's kind of supporting it um, the other thing, too, is I need to turn off this. Quiet hours, thank you. Um, his proportions, I've been kind of coming to grips with. I feel like his head is kind of, he's got a pretty large head, right? And a very more uh, lithe is the word for it, thinner, thinner type body. So you got to remember to push his proportions a bit more. And. So there we are in terms of gesture. Let's try and get our proportions in a little bit better. Maybe center this a bit more. Maybe even scale it down to some, um, let's have some room to work with. And this arm's like this. And again, this this hand will be on the string, I would assume, I'm thinking. And maybe even it's coming up a little higher. The bow could be a little higher. And again, I'm working very loosely and roughly because a lot of this is still changing. I'm not quite sure of some of the positioning. And this is a very busy area right now because there's a lot of action going on here. We have a lot of hands and there's paraphernalia. There's a Sheikah slate that may or may not get added. So this hand, is this arm's too long. We can take it down a bit. And it's been a while since I've done one of these live sketches, so I feel kind of out of practice in terms of getting things done quickly. Let's get these gestural notes in there quickly. So if this is his hand, so this needs to come up even further. Let's push it up a little higher along more along his, his belt line. And of course, if my audio is not sounding fantastic, please sound out in the chat room and I will attempt to fix. Let's start building him out a little bit. I think we have a pretty decent working gesture going on. So this probably needs to come up a little bit. And I'll have to figure out where that hand's gonna go. Important one, I think, are these overlapping screen screen right arm. And with a look of determination. The 
looking over here someplace. I don't like his eyes looking down so much. Maybe a little more up here somewhere. There we go. Okay. Save. And I've got the leggings. And I think the boots are pretty simplified. I'm just going to put in a wedge shape for the foot. All right, now let's zoom out a little bit and give it a squint. You can give it a flip before I start really tweaking it. So what is bothering me here? Into the head a bit more over his chest mass. He needs to have his head cranial mass built out a bit more here. And let's blow his let's get his little hairs flowing a bit more. Same thing with his tunic. It is called Breath of the Wild after all, so. Knees should probably come up higher. Well, let's just do a little Photoshop trickery. I'm making them a little too long, I think. So it's a little more runty than what I'm, than what I'm doing right now. Flip this back a little better. So let's move another layer. Let's bust this down, pull the opacity down. Uh, I don't want to call this tie down. Well, maybe what I can do actually, we can pull the opacity of our brush up a bit, maybe a little heavier. Start refining some of this. Time. Let's see what we're looking at here. Uh, Eighteen minutes. Okay, so I'm doing okay. I feel like in this one, his hair, his hair, what are, the, what are these? What do you call these? I don't even know what you would refer to these as. Uh, they're like longer than normal, than typical. And he's a little more rounded too. His features are more rounded. I like his heavy eye eyebrows from from um, the cell shaded ones. So I'm gonna maybe inject a little bit of that in, into this pose. Let's fix this eye line a bit. Okay, let's keep moving along. Let's streamline this. By streamline, I mean this is a nice clean line right there. And down into the elbow. And we can build out this forearm a bit. And again, I got the placement of the bow kind of in the wrong place, but we can scooch it.
thin, it's thicker here and thinner here. And then our string goes along there someplace. Build his chest out some. Nose maybe a little low. Let's pull his nose up. All right, let's keep doing that a little bit so you can see what the heck we're looking at. And make sure we get that in there, a little piece of his hip. Possibly a hint of his belt. Okay. Going on time, maybe at 15. Yeah, 14 and a half. So we've got. You know, the challenge of the live sketches is that I'm trying to move really, I'm trying to get it in as quick as possible. So that is the that's the deal with that. So a lot of this is about being accurate. It's a good a good exercise of being accurate. All right. So what we have Now I feel like I've got a good handle on what, where things should be. So I'll go down here and make a tie down. Maybe we'll start really starting to punch up. I'll spend more time on his head, so I'm pretty sure most people are interested in his, his features. And let's thin this out a bit more. Maybe pull the flow up a little bit. Let's get a look at the reference. I don't like that. thought I was in harmony for a second there. I started triggering the harmony. Trying to keep the roundness of his face. <clears throat> time. Ten minutes, eleven minutes. I think it's enough time to probably get going on maybe some color. We'll see.
That year was a little thicker than the other one, so that needs to be thinned out. And I like the darker eyebrows from previous incarnations. Let's see if I can get his eye shape correct. You see. Round it out a little bit. Oops, that dipped down a bit too much. Let's thicken these lids. Still want to make sure I have enough room in there. Rick's met in Twitch. Yeah, I know. I, I am playing it. <laughs> I'm playing it uh, when I can, of course. You know, it's a matter of finding time, really. How have you been? Doing well. Not doing animation today. I'm doing some sketching. And probably only going to be on for maybe a few more minutes. Looks like five and a half more minutes. I think I can get pretty far with this sketch. What's going on with this? So these are just kind of like wrap, wrappings. Wrap, yeah. And uh, yeah, a little bit of 
Oh, wait. So I'm incorrect. There is this... The, the Looks like it's only on that other arm, this arm here. And then his gloves. Whoops. Hey, oh, color. I need to spend a little more time on figuring out where things are going. Here in the hand. Right now it's a little, it's a little gooey, and that's probably because I'm starting to rush because I feel the need to get to a certain point with this, um, and that's not good. I don't know. It's like one of the struggles I have with this with the live sketch in general. It's always like I feel like I'm trying to move quickly because it's part of the challenge of it. And at the same time, I'm like, am I doing myself any justice? So I probably should just slow down a little bit and do a cleaner job. We should probably duck down here. You do IT work, Rick Matt? Nothing wrong with that. All right, now I just drew this hand on another layer on purpose because I wasn't I was constructing it. So I'll go back down in here and tie it down a bit more. Check my time. I've got about a minute and forty left. Just probably not going to be enough to get through the rest of this drawing, but we'll continue it off stream. Yeah, too big. And actually this bow should probably come around here somewhere. Yeah, because if I'm looking at this side to this side, so one of two things needs to happen here. I can maybe split the difference. I can bring them both back in a little bit. And this one can come out a bit more. Something like this. And of course the string is here someplace. He's getting ready to notch an arrow. I know his guy's ponytail, his little samurai looking ponytail. Right? There it is. 
There's my 25 minutes. Yeah, I used to be a 3D animator and went into IT because it was more secure. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> that certainly sounds about right. Um, so I got pretty far with this. Um, I mean, as usual, I get pretty far with any particular drawing on the live sketch, and I usually finish it throughout the course of the week. I pick away at it here and there, but I got a pretty good chunk done. I'll probably go back in and adjust the eyes a little bit. I'm not exactly thrilled with how they came out. Um, so, I mean, it's, 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 okay. it's okay for what it is. Uh, I'm going to have to sign off for now, guys. I need to get back to work. Um, so what I'm going to do is, uh, in the recording of this, you will see a few buttons in front of you. At least I'm assuming you are. You are. Uh, click that subscribe button to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Follow me on Twitter, Tumblr, Google+, Blogger to see updates of this drawing and anything else. Uh, thanks, guys, for hanging out with me. I appreciate it, and take care.